this is Captain Chaudhary. Today I am going to talk about doing the rendezvous on the chart. If you have the target vessel on your own chart, how to do the rendezvous calculations. How to find out the course to steer to meet the disabled ship or a ship that you want to uh, reach. So uh, uh, let us say there is a chart with these uh, outlines. Right. Probably this is the position of the target vessel and this is the position of old ship. This is the target ship and it is known that the target ship is steering say 200 uh, course of 200 degrees through and at the rate of uh, say maybe 4 knots. Now uh, the ship is somehow forced to go in this direction. And we need to meet the ship. We are capable of doing 16 knots. Okay, uh, maybe uh, these are the shore features, maybe a beacon over here. This is open sea, right? So you need to uh, meet the target vessel at 16 knots. Now in these kind of calculations it is very important to know like uh, the position of the target vis-a-vis -vis the position of own ship at the same time. So let us say the target is here at uh, 1600 hours and own ship is here at 1600 hours. The first thing that you should do is join the two ships position which is indicated for the same time. That means the target is here at 1600, you are here at uh, uh, 1600. Target speed is 4 knots and your speed is 16 knots. Probably while the target moves so much you are able to move much more. Now I pick up 4 miles from here. Take a distance of 4 miles from here, 1, 2, 3, 4 and I cut an arc over here because the target moves 4 miles in 1 hour. In 1 hour own ship will move 16 miles so I will uh, take a measure of 16 miles from the scale 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. From this point, I will cut an arc of 16 miles and then join it. This is uh, old ship's distance in one hour. This is the target vessel's distance in one hour. Once I have got this triangle, then what I will do is parallel to this line, I will draw a line from my present position and this is going to be the meeting point. This is going to be meeting point. So this is how uh, it is a, a very simple two step exercise to find out what is the course to steer to meet uh, a disabled vessel. So once again quickly we join the position cut a distance of 4 miles that is the speed of the target and from here I cut an arc of 16 miles which is my speed. This is the course to steer. And uh, this is the distance, of course, traveled in one hour by own ship. But now in this rendezvous, I can find out what time uh, we'll probably meet. So if I uh, consider that the target moves so much in one hour, so much in two hours, it is slightly over two hours. And if I measure on my course, it is one hour and then two hours, slightly over two hours. So uh, let us say we might meet at around 18.09. Uh, Right. Starting at 1600 at the target position and own position we meet at 1809. Suppose both the vessels they face the same current. Say it is easterly 2 knots. Which means that in about 2 hours and 9 minutes it will be a little over 4 miles. Right. That means the meeting point is going to be 1, 2, 3, 4. 4 point something. 
the target is going to make good this course and we are going to make good this course and we don't have to worry about the set and drift if the same current is applicable to both the ships course to steer and interval will be the same this is how you do rendezvous on the chart where you have both own ship and target vessel on the same chart you can uh, do a simple calculation simple plotting and find out what time you will meet and what is the course to steer whether there is current or there is no current